Uh, hey everyone, it's Wednesday again, and I guess I lied about making a blog post sooner. <laughs> Soon. Um, it's been a long, well, weekend, everything, uh, I only had two days rest before I had to get on a bus to go to SeaTac. And let me tell you about that. <laughs> Uh, so, I got on the bus, filled out my card to get me across the border, and we had to take all our luggage with us across the border. So we go to get back on the bus, and our luggage has to go back in it, and the guy driving the bus asks me where I'm going, and I say Seattle, and then to San Diego at the airport, and uh... So he puts it away, and it's all good, we're going, we're driving, it's actually really quite relaxing. And then we get to SeaTac, and my, uh, my, my nice little blue bag isn't on the bus, because I did not realize that SeaTac was something that had to be specified differently from Seattle. So, uh, I told him what it looked like, and gave him my phone number and where I was staying, and I decided to wait at the airport for about an hour to see, because I thought, well, what if they phone me and I'm like halfway to my hotel? And so I wait, and I wait for an over an hour, and I'm like, well, I, I guess I better, uh, I guess I better go to my hotel, because at this point I'm thinking, oh, they're not going to find it, and I'm going to need to buy new clothes and charging cords for my, for my laptop and my, my cell phone. And so, uh, I have a bit of a, it, It was a bit difficult for me to find my way to, uh, what is it? Where are we? International Boulevard. And I was looking around and I had a taxi drive appointment me in the right direction because there's this light rail system and it goes over the highway and back down to International, uh, blah, 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 International Boulevard. So that worked out okay and I just kept walking and it was really sunny out because it was like almost four at this point and I was like, oh, it's hot. I don't have my stuff. This is horrible. So I get in to my hotel and I want to check in but the person at the front desk is talking on the phone and I don't want to bother her. And I hear something about her and bags and being delivered. I'm like, that could be me. But then she gets another phone call, another two phone calls. I'm like, well, I'll wait a little bit longer. And I go to check in and they're like, oh, we found your bag. They found your bags and they'll be delivering them soon. I'm like, that's great. That turned out good. Luckily, they found it and I don't have to buy everything again. So that was really nice to not have to spend that extra money and have it found. But uh, I'll, I'll know better next time to not... Uh, know which stop I'm getting off at. So, it's about 8.20. I'll be having a shower before I go to bed, because that's unusual for me. I usually shower in the morning, but I have to wake up at 4 a.m. and catch my shuttle, shuttle at about 4.45, and then get through security and get to where my plane is. So I'm going to bed early, <laughs> and um, the plane's not departing until 7.15, but you need at least an hour to get through security and all that. I'm not looking forward to that, and it's even crazier because when I come back on Monday, my flight leaves at 6.30, 30-ish, so I have to get up at like 3.30 to leave. Um, trying to save money, and then this is just more effort than the money saved is worth, if you ask me. And 
kind of sad that I'm leaving so early on September because it's the last day at the zoo. I'm sure they're going to do something awesome. Steam Power Giraffe is probably going to do something really cool. And Bunny even said so herself that, that her makeup is going to be really crazy. So I'm sad I'm going to miss that. Um, yes, shower, go to bed, uh, hopefully sleep well, the bit noisy here with the highway being very close, and you know, the airport also being very close, uh, yeah, here's, here's my, my lovely two queen beds that only one is going to be used. Yay. And there's, there's my stuff. And I gotta pack everything up, mostly again, before I leave, before I go to sleep tonight. So everything's ready and hopefully I'll have enough time to find food in the airport and not be too picky about it. I'm sure I'll be hungry and they don't feed you on your flight. You have to pay for that. Not free. And uh, at least there's a stopover in San Francisco for an hour so I can get food then. But I'm not leaving the airport. That would be stupid. You need an hour just to get through security. Not leaving. Once I'm through security, I'm staying in. So, um,. Hopefully that'll go well and I won't get pulled aside for any random checks. I would hate that. So this has been another vlog post by Curatory or Amanda or whatever you'd like to call me. That is a positive nickname. Um, so. Uh, thanks for watching, and have a good day.